So I'm back with the Samsung bagless canister vacuum. I have this pretty thick pile carpet that hasn't been vacuumed in I don't remember how long. So we're going to vacuum it with the Samsung. It has a clean bin. So we're going to turn it on. Turn the brush roll on. And there we go. See the amount of dust just from that one spot. That one spot. You kind of really got to push it on some carpets because it locks down. I mean, it's cleaning and it's doing a good job, but it just, it really locks down to the carpet, so you really got to move easily. Fits under things nicely. You can see the dirt sensor, how it's changing from green to red. You can see it follow. See it clean under the bed. Kind of clean side. There's no real brush contact with edges, it's all just the airflow. I can hear it pulling everything out of the carpet. Only thing is, let's turn the brush roll off. This right here, oh, turn it on. This right here is too big, so it doesn't really fit under little spaces like that. The rainbow head can fit perfectly under that, but this, it's too big and bulky and it won't fit all the way under some things and you can't really lay it down completely flat see it's still it's pretty tall so that's the only downside about it
pull this over here. You can see how well it's grooming the carpet. Okay. So we're done vacuuming the room. Looks very nice. So here's the dirt bin. You can see there's a lot of pet hair. Let's open it. There's all the dust and dirt. And hair gets wrapped around that. And the filter is in here. Let's see if I can open it with one hand. Uh, just a second. Need the two hands for that. But I have it open, and to remove the filter, you pull up on this. But when I remove it, this is what I see. You can see the filter is becoming very, very clogged with pet hair, dirt. I don't know if this is supposed to happen, but we're gonna see how long I can use this machine before I have to clean this because it's getting very dirty and so it's going to reduce the performance of the vacuum and then now that I have that out you can see it gets very dirty I don't know why it gets so dirty but you can see there's a whole bunch of dust all up in here you can see that's where the exhaust from this hooks up there's dust on that, but here's the HEPA filter. You just click this over, lift it up. There's like a charcoal filter right here to reduce the odors. You gotta pull it out like this. Hold on. Okay, so I have it out. Here's the HEPA filter. It honestly doesn't look that dirty. Like, you can see a little bit, but it's not that bad. So, and there's another foam filter right there that's catching stuff. That's pretty thick foam filter. It's like an inch or two thick when you push down on it. But, it looks nice. It seems to clean very well. It has a lot of power. So, would I recommend this vacuum? I would say yes. Get it. Try it out. See if you like it. It has a tremendous amount... Uh, amount of airflow and suction so stay tuned and please like comment and subscribe thank you